What's going on YouTube? Jeans here, bringing you guys some brand new content for Pokemon Sword and Shield. The Isle of Armor DLC is finally here, and I'm going to be showing it off, doing a miniature playthrough on it for you guys. So if you are hyped, make sure you support the channel by smashing that like button and clicking that big red subscribe button. Seriously, it goes a long way. We're sitting here at Wedgehurst, the Wedgehurst station. So once you buy the armor pass or the DLC, whatever you want, you get an armor pass, which means you go to the Wedgehurst station right here and you talk to this guy right here and he is going to see your little armor pass and he's going to be like, yo, where do you want to go? We're like the armor station. We want to head over to the Isle of Armor and look at this. It takes us to a train over to this little area and I believe we get like a Corviknight taxi and he flies us across to the brand new Isle of Armor. Look at this place. Let's get it. I'm so hyped for this new DLC. Guys, let me know in the comment section down below what are you most hyped for for the new DLC. For me, I just like exploring and catching all new Pokemon. So that's going to be my new little hype thing. But yo, let's go. Let's get it. This is my first reaction for everything. I haven't really seen too, too much about the Isle of Armor. I just know how to get there and all that good stuff. And we are finally here. Is this your first visit to the Isle of Armor? Yes, it is. This is it. I'm researcher Pokemon biology here on the island. You want to register your Pokemon, you catch the island to your Pokedex, right? I'll update your Pokedex so you can do just that. Okay, so it's kind of like a whole new little area. Okay, I'm down with it, guys. I'm down with it. Yo, if you guys want to catch more content from me, I am going to be uh, doing a lot of DLC content over on my Twitch page. So link in the description below, Gene25 on Twitch. So I'm going to be doing like a playthrough, doing the story mode and whatnot over here. And then uh, on my Twitch page, I'm going to be like catching all the Pokemon and exploring it a little bit more. Which station would you like to head, head to? Oh, wait a minute. I got to go out this way. Okay, so I got to go out this way. There we go. Ooh, we yo, the Isle of Armor. Who's this guy? Who is this guy? I don't even know. I'm supposed to join the dojo on this island today. There's a strange person standing outside the station, and I'm a bit scared to head out. Yo, I'll head out there. I'll show him what's good, but yo, look at my trainer. I haven't changed my trainer yet. If you guys are new to the channel, it's like a little running joke on my channel. I didn't, my trainer card hasn't been changed, and I haven't changed my uh, outfit yet. But yo, this is the person that we saw to catch the Galarian Slowpoke. She headed over. I believe she's like a gym leader around here. Let's go. This is Clara. Hello, Clara. I've been at the dojo a while, so they sent me here to help out the newbie. What dojo? Oh, come on. I know you're, you're a new student who's supposed to join the Master Dojo. Oh, yeah, yeah. We joined that Master Dojo. Did we just get Cub Fu? I know we get Cub Fu, and I know we can have the choice to get Squirtle and Bulbasaur. But, yo, let's go. I hope Armor's finally here. This is hype. This is actually really hype because Pokemon, the old po Pokemon company, actually, like, uh, made this at a perfect time. And, like, Pokemon Sword and Shield hasn't died out yet, and then they give us the this DLC to boost it up again. But yo, Panorama Shop. Ooh, ooh wee. Look at this. The Galarian Slowpokes. Yo, oh my god, I'm hyped for Pokemon. I'm so hyped for it. Hee <laughs> I bet this is your first time on the Isle of Armor. I bet you can't wait to ex start exploring. But first things first, we need to make sure you are ready. Ready? Do I gotta battle you? Bro, all my Pokemon are level 100, but I know there's level scaling. So I got a stack team right here. I believe I have like Inteleon, Dragapult, Excadrill, Titar, Gyarados, and Chandelure. Who is it? Ooh, Venipede. Ooh, yo. It's going to be so hyped to see a bunch of new Pokemon. She only has two. She's taking it easy on us. But yeah, supposedly there's like level scaling. So depending on what level your Pokemon are, there'll be level uh, for these Pokemon. But still. But still. My Pokemon are level 100. They're all like max DVs and all that good stuff. These things are absolute beasts. Let's go, Inteleon takes out. This is actually a team I used, like, for my first ever Ranked Battles video. We just dominated it. But yeah, I stacked up on, uh, Pokeballs and all that, so I, I'm gonna be able to catch all different new things, show it off to you guys. But yeah, we should be able to run through the story pretty, pretty fast, and there's, just get to explore and complete the Pokedex more and more. But back to what I was saying with, the uh, with how the Pokemon company made everything, like, fresh. They didn't let Pokemon die out. They gave us the starters. They gave us new abilities for the uh, competitive play. Let this game, like, get a little bit of boost from that. And then put this DLC out at the perfect time. Now everybody is hyped for Pokemon Sword and Shield again. And then we still have one more DLC to complete, which will be the Crown Tundra, which comes out later in the fall. More of, like, um, holiday 2020. But there we go. We defeated Clara as our first little mission on this little Isle of Armor. Dude, come on, let me go explore. Let me go explore all this stuff. You know, I don't really want to talk, but I believe we have to head to the dojo if I had to guess. It's like the only thing. Yep, there's the dojo. We're away. We're just away from the master dojo. She's going to give me a style card. What's the style card do? Put style card in your pocket. A card that increases the selection in boutiques and hair salons. Okay. Not like I go to it anyway. <laughs> I have like 400 hours in this game and I haven't touched my outfit. But yeah, we are chilling here. I get to explore as I please. And oh my lord. Wailord? Galarian Slowpoke? I have them already. 
Yo, Kingler. Oh my lord. What is that? Oh, Chansey. Is Chansey in this game yet? Who is that? Who is that? Yo, get out of here, King. Oh, Klefki. I love Klefki. Yo, I'm catching this thing. Bro, yo, I love armor. I was wondering what this thing was. I was looking at it. I was like, what the heck is this thing? It's my boy, Klefki. Let's see if I can just throw a uh, ultra ball at it. See if I can get a catch. Do I have any, uh, what are those balls called? The quick balls? Yeah, yo, I got one quick ball. I'm going to send it real quick. Real quick, quick ball right here. For our first catch on the Isle of Armor. Can we get Klefki? Come on, there's third shake. Show it to me. No! <laughs> Klefki, I got to get somebody with uh, like ball swipe or something. I think it rolls a magic room. I'm just going to throw an ultra ball at it. Going to throw an ultra ball at this thing. Yo, are you serious? Where's my ultra balls at? What are you at? Should I master ball Klefki? <laughs> Use an ultra ball. I do have to get a Pokemon with, uh, what is it, false swipe? Usually rocks out. Yo, show me third shake. Click it, click it, first catch. Yo, let's get it. Klefki was caught one out of 100 on the Isle of Armor. I heard there's like a, a Lola Diglett thing where you have to ha find like 150, one of them. That's pretty dope. That is pretty dope. Yo, seriously, if this is your guys' first time checking out my content, make sure you support it. If you guys do enjoy, smash that like button and click that subscribe button. Benary! Benary here. Yeah, seriously, it goes a long way. Thank you guys for all the support that has been going out on my channel. But yeah, so my plan is for uh, this playthrough, I'm going to be uh, exploring every single area, catching a few Pokemon per area, and then just uh, completing the story mode and all that. So right now, I'm just uh, over here catching some new Pokemon. And we got a critical catch, so that's an easy catch right there. Boop! Quick little click. You can tell if you get a critical catch when it shakes in the air. That's pretty dope. But yes, sir, yo, Benario. We get all these new Pokemon. So now there's 500? Right? But yo, the Crown Tundra, I think, is going to outdo the Isle of Armor. But Isle of Armor is still going to be amazing. There's Jigglypuff. I'll let some, some Pokemon slide. Toxapex chilling on the beach. Yo, this is nuts. This is nuts. Just look at this. We got new fishing holes. We got all that spots right there. I'm going to head over here. I'm going to head over to the Master Dojo. But yo, the Whale Lord looks phenomenal. This game is insane, yo. I'm in love. I am in love. Let's go head over to the grass. See if we got any cool new Pokemon that I haven't seen yet. I would love to get like a, a, a Sprinks. Well, however, Shrinks. The Luxray's first stage because I absolutely love Luxray. There's a little hidden Pokemon. What is that? That Ditto. I think that's Ditto in there. And Benary. Yeah, that's Ditto and Benary. <laughs> we got Ditto and Benary chilling there. Ah, bro. Oh, bro, Alkazam's in here. Come here, boy. Oh, yo. We got to sneak up on that thing. But we got a Pokeball over here. Yo, Alkazam's here. We got a Sunstone as well. Alkazam. Oh, my God. He's going to be so much fun using a competitive play. Come here. Yo, what you mean? What you mean, Abra? Come here. You keep teleporting. Come here, boy. There we go. We got the Abra. Let's catch this thing real quick. He shouldn't be too hard to catch. Just one Ultra Ball. Should do the trick. But, yo, I cannot wait because we have all this content to do. And then even after we complete the Isle of Armor, then competitive play is totally changed. We got a hundred new Pokemon that we can use in competitive and use on different teams. Like, oh my lord, yo. Pokemon Sword Shield back on top. Back on top. Nice little, little critical catch there. We gonna roll out here. Dude, look at my team. My team's absolutely stacked. I might want to throw other Pokemon in there, but for right now, I'm just uh exploring. Probably in the next episode, I'm gonna throw like a bunch of new Pokemon that we call it inside my party. For right now, I just want to have a stacked squad. Let's just explore over here and then head up to the Master Dojo. What we got here? Benaries, yo. Benaries crack me up. <laughs> There's like floating around, running around at all times. More Benaries. We got Klefkies and Benaries are just chilling on this spot. Chansey. So, hello, Chansey. Hello, Chansey. For some reason, I thought we already had Chansey, but I we definitely do not. What's this lady? What's this lady? Yo, dude, the Whale Lord's. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go over to the Whale Lord. Can I not hop on my, my bike? There we go. Oh, my Lord. Yo. Yo, hold up. Hold up. Workout seat. Yo, is it going to thunder? Wingles? Bruh. Bruh, what is that? Sharpedo? Yo, come here. Come here, yo. Sharpedo, are you serious? You see how that thing came after us? Bruh, that thing was charging at us. That is amazing, yo. Come here, Sharpedo. I'm catching you with this Ultra Ball. Sharpedo is one of my favorite water Pokemon. I love his design. He's so sick. Come on, give me the triple shakes. Come on, one more. Give me the click. Give me the click, click. Bruh, what you mean? So close. Sharpedo goes for a crunch. This kid better slow his roll. And he's gonna drop my stats, my defense. It's so weird. Like, I've just been focusing on ranked battles, so it's so much fun to get back into actually, like, playing Pokemon. Like, oh my god, dude. This game, this game, this Isle of Armor, like, just seeing what they are doing now in the Isle of Armor, like, the Crown Tundra is probably gonna be better than the Isle of Armor, and then what are they going to do in the next game? Like, the next Pokemon game is going to be amazing, because I said the same thing about this and Breath of the Wild. These two games are just test games. 
Like the next gen is going to be insane. It's going to be unreal. There's tentacle. Another Sharpedo. Can you please not charge that for me, Sharpedo? I'm not trying to deal with you. Yo. Look at this dude. I don't even want to catch him. I just want to go check him out. <laughs> Look at this dude. Well, Lord, what's good? Oh, my Lord. It's Sharpedo's Hunter Dale. <laughs> what is this, yo? We got Sharpedo's attacking us. But, yo, well, Lord's chilling here. We're going to go head over to the Master Dojo after this and get going with the story mode. Yo, this is insane. What's good, Whale Lord? What is good? This place looks amazing. We got a Big Max raid. Oh my god, Jelly Sense here. And I hit a tentacle. Come on, get out of here. <laughs> but yo, are you kidding me? I wonder uh, what are in the Max raids. You guys watched the Pokemon present? There was a, uh, like, Mega Zorora. Not Mega Zorora, just Zorora in itself. And if a, th a million people do it, then you get a, what's it called? Then everyone gets a shiny one, which is pretty dope. These Sharpedos are going to annoy me, I'm telling you. Where are they at? Oh my lord, here comes one. Run! Get out of here! <laughs> yo, get out my face. Leave me alone. Okay, he's gone. We did them out, but yo, that was, that was dope. We went over there, we checked the whale lord. There's plenty of little islands. That's pretty cool. Maybe we'll check them out later, but it's weird. Oh, yo. Look at that thing. That's a Pokemon, isn't it? <laughs> it's like one of those uh, Hawaiian, uh, I don't even know what they're called. The little Hawaiian things, but yo, look, there's a little dicklet right here. <laughs> Duh, duh. Diglett, what's good? <laughs> oh, Diglett, you're here. Yo, it's a little like trainer guy. So this is what I was talking about in the beginning when I said there's like 150 to 151 Diglets. And if, if you find them all, you get something. I don't even know what you get, but you do get something. This is a Lowen Diglett though. Look at this little hair. His hair is cracking me up. Anyway, you found a Diglett buried in the ground. You definitely have a talent for finding Diglets. If it's okay, will you find all the other Diglets too? Sure, but the thing is, you don't tell me that there's 150. Yeah, see, you found one diglet so far, so find 150 more diglets. If you find them, please tell me and come back to me. So there we go, we have 150 diglets to find. I'll probably be cranking those out over on my streams. Like I said, Jeans25 over on that Twitch page. Yo, what's good, everybody? I'll catch all of you guys later. What we got over here? Any any newbies over here? This game, this game is beautiful. Let's head up into the dojo and get started with this. Let's get started with this. We got Claire chilling over here. What's good, Claire? And the dojo. Yo, look at that face. It has like Cub Fu or I don't even know how to say it. the second stage. Or a Super Fu. I don't even know. I don't even know. Seems that way. Yep. Blah, blah, blah. He suddenly left. No, I did not suddenly left. I'm right here. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, were you talking smack on me? Were you talking smack on me? Why is that face like that? I've whomped on you and now we're here. But, yo, what's good, Claire? Right, 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 right. Exactly. Ma'am, I swear he must have changed his mind about joining. No, you're such a liar. You're such a liar. I said I'd be here as soon as possible. You're just jealous. My intelligence just slapped on your little venipede and whatever else it was. <laughs> but yo, she out of here. She's got like some problem with me or something. But I don't care. I'm going to head in this dojo. And I believe we get to pick between Squirtle or Bulbasaur, which um, I don't really know who I should pick. I have both of them. But, and hopefully we get Kubfu. I think we do. I think we get Kubfu early and we train him up. I think that's how this whole Isle of Armor works. Oh, <gasps> my boy. Kubfu, what's good? Dude, look at my dude. Oh, he went. What? Where'd he go? Bro, please give me cup food right now. Give me my boy. I'm heading inside. Let's get it. If you guys watch the Pokemon present, we got like a bunch of new little details. And there's going to be another one next week. We got Pokemon Snap details. I was waiting for a Gen 4 remake. Probably like all of you guys. But we did not get that. Hopefully next week that can happen. And we can get like a release date. Or at least confirmation that it's in the works. You know what I'm saying? But yo, hey everybody, I have an announcement to make. We got a new student joining us. Please welcome Jeans. Yeah, let's go. My boy Jeans. It's me. Yo, look at Polyrath. Polyrath's up in here. He's ready to go. Look at that dude. Look at Polyrath's a monster. Oh, we got an XP charm. I heard about this. So what the XP charm is, is instead of like an XP share, if I give it to one Pokemon, so say we have Cub Fu on our team, all the XP will just go towards uh, the one Pokemon instead of just spreading it out between all six of them. That's pretty dope. We got this old man, Wilkers, right here. What's up, Wilkers? This is Mustard right here. <laughs> Why, hello there. My name is Mustard. I'm rather good at Pokemon battles, you know. I'm pleased as cheese that you could join us. Okay. Uh, nice to meet you, dude. He's such a polite student. You seem to be a hardworking type, too. Don't let him fool you into thinking he's just a silly old man. He's a real beast when he gets serious. Yo, what's good? You know who I am? You know who I am? Yo, this dude doesn't know who we are. Let's go talk to him. Yo, what's good, Mustardo? Are you ready for a battle? Yes, sir. Yo, let's get it. I just want that cub food. Yeah, I don't I don't really know how much the story is, but I feel like they put a good amount of uh, content in this DLC with the 100 Pokemon you can catch, and then uh, 
like I said, on top of that, you got the competitive side with all these Pokemon. You got the Diglets to collect. <gasps> and look at this. We got my food. Bruh. Oh, my God. Let's get it. Yippee. Oh, I just can't wait to see you battle your heart out. Yo, let's go. The new wild areas are the best. Level 61. I'm just going to scald this thing. This thing, this thing faked me out, really. <laughs> this thing really faked me out just for a little bit of damage. What's good, yo? We're going to be slapping up. I just want my cub food. Cub food looks so dope. See you later, punk. I like how this guy's like trying real hard, and my Italian is just like finger pointing and taking out with a scald. <laughs> Shinx, yo. Shinx right here. I want one of these things. But yo, that water was so cool. The first scene that they made with the water and the whale lord out in the back. Beautiful. Beautiful. Shinx learns Intimidate? Okay. Okay, I cannot wait to get this thing up in competitive play. Get Luxray up in there? Yo, dude. Dude, people were telling me, because I had a question today in a couple videos ago. It was like, oh, what should I do? Should I do a playthrough of this or just stick with Rank Battles? Everyone was like, yo, dude, do a playthrough. Check it out. So, hope you guys are all enjoying the content. But Rank Battles will come straight after the playthroughs or in between them. I'm going to keep it fresh and keep rolling from there. But, yo, we destroyed Mustard. Everyone's surprised. You're pretty strong, aren't you? Heck, yeah, I'm pretty strong. Hey, the newbie won. Master wasn't going all out, but that's still pretty impressive. Who is that kid anyway? It's your boy, Gene, Joe. It's Gene's. <laughs> the way you battle really shows me how you care about Pokemon. Even if you come... I don't even know what he was trying to say, but here we go. We're just going to keep going. He gives us, like, a little handshake, and he gives us a dojo uniform, which I think I got to put on. Do I just throw it on? And this is my first time changing my outfit. Look at us. We looking spiffy. Look at our hair, yo. Our hair is long. It's flowed out. We got a little scrafty in the back. He's chilling. Hey, newbie. What's good? If you want to change... Or just take a break. Use that room over there. Okay. Beautiful. Good to know. Now then. Give me cup food. With Gene's here, the dojo is at max capacity. It's time to really start our training. You and all. Oh, we will face three trials. Okay, so there's a max capacity for the dojo. You will receive the secret armor. Okay, so now we have three trials in this little thing right here. And I don't know what the trials are. I guess they're battles. I really do not know what they are. But yo, Muster, what's good? Claire's trying to, was talking work on us earlier, so I really want to, whoa, what was that? <laughs> but Claire was talking work on us, and I really want to slap her up. Someone took the dojo uniform? Slowpoke? That's speed, wow. Really, these slowpokes, yo, these things are fast. For slowpokes? Galarian slowpokes. What's goody? <laughs> are these things actually, like, fast? Like, is there speed on them? <laughs> Look at him running away, but is their speed like boosted better than a regular slowpoke? That'd be pretty cool. Kind of give him a whole different thing. You got and chase after those things fast. Ba ba ba. Where? Do I have to go? Did he just say I have to go catch them? I'm not dealing with that. Where's he going? Dressing room? So I think we gotta do our three trials. Which could be pretty awesome. These kids are absolutely stunned. <laughs> Look at their faces. <laughs> or do we have to catch the slowpokes? I think we gotta catch the slowpokes. <laughs> you want no I want I want to keep this I want to keep my clothes time to chase down those fast slow pokes okay so now I gotta go get the slow pokes I guess these are the, like one of the trials slow pokes are just cooking and this gives us a reason to explore everything but yo what's good slow pokes are they gonna start running yeah there you go <laughs> they yeet on over to the right side I guess this is their way of making us explore the different wilder yo look at that that looks amazing these things are cooking, though. Oh, my lord. Bro, I'm stunned. This is amazing. Let's go. Let's go get this slow, folks. I'm going to head to the other side. What's goody? Yo, where's the down thing? There we go. We're going to head down here. Like I said, I'm going to explore everything in depth. Oh, what is this? You have an awesome bike. Let's customize it. No, I do not want to customize it. But I'm going to explore everything in depth over on my Twitch page. Like I said, link in the description below. We are in the soothing wetlands. And look at this. Look at this. This is beautiful. Oh, my lord. Big bull guy. I forget his name. I forget his name. He's kind of like a Tauros, but he's not. There's a Slowpoke. Come here, Slowpoke. Quagsire. Whoopers. They were already in the game. I gotta go get, to get them. Is that Miraculous over there? Dreadnaws. Fletchinder? Oh my lord. Come here, yo. Dude, the Slowpoke's cooking. Give me a second. I gotta get this boy. And I wanna look at all the Pokemon. I know I'm gonna hit a Pokemon. Where'd you go? Come here. Come here. These things are cooking. Get over here, boy. Yo, what is this? Cutting this way, yeah. I got you. I got him. Do I gotta capture these thing? I think I gotta catch him. Oh, it's fast slow poke. Defeat it. Defeat it or catch it? Do I just have to defeat it. Harsh sunlight here. 
Can I catch it here? Okay, no, I can't I can't catch it. I have to catch it later, so I'm just gonna ice beam it. Take it out. Bro, dude, this wetland's amazing. And there's harsh sunlight here, which is pretty dope. These slow pokes be cooking. But yeah, I was focused on the slow poke instead of just uh soaking it all in at first. Because I saw that thing, I was like, I gotta get it. I gotta get it for the story. You know what I'm saying? Slow. We got the Claire's Dojo jacket back. Oh, that wasn't miraculous. Is this thing? I forget that thing's name. But dude, oh my, oh my lord, everything looking sick. Chancy chilling here. Dreadnaughts just floating around here. Oh my god. Little Choodles. Does that thing look kind of shiny? Because he has a blue back. <laughs> what else we got over here? What is that? Oh, that's a Scorpio. The Scorpio's chilling here. There's another Slowpoke. Let me go get that thing while I'm here. Come here, Slowpoke. Yo, Talonflame. I'm looking dope. Come here, buddy. We got the next Slowpoke chilling here. Talonflame in the game. Come on. Yeah, I cannot wait to use a uh, Klefki in ranked battles as well. Like, that's going to be awesome. Klefki's, Klefki is such a cool Pokemon. Roll out with an Ice Beam. The Yagi. Get it. But yeah, one more Slowpoke here. I don't know if we get uh, Kubfu at the end of the playthrough or end of the DLC or the beginning. I think I thought we get him in the beginning. I thought you get him and you level him up and all that and you have him around. But there we go. We got the Dojo T and Dojo Shorts. There should be one last Slowpoke left. I don't know if he's floating around this area or did he go forward more. So I'm just going to... Get back on my bike. We got whoopers. Oh my lord, Dreadnought. Dude, this game, this DLC. I'm absolutely stunned by it. Like, huge, huge. Like, congrats to Pokemon Company putting this together. It's so good. Yo, Licky Tongue. What's good? What's good, Licky Tongue? There's the last Slowpoke. Come here, boy. I see you over here. I thought that thing was Blossom at first. Yo, I see you. Come here. Come here, buddy. Right here. There we go. Hit this up. And then we head back to the dojo, I believe. But, dude, these two first areas are amazing. Are amazing. Ban it, ban it, ban it. So, like I said in the beginning, I'm most hyped for catching all the new Pokemon and just exploring this new island, and it has not let me down yet. Like, seeing all these new Pokemon and seeing the whole new, like, design wild areas. Like, these look, this place looks so much better than the original wild areas in the original game. Like, they did such a good job here. I love it. But there we go. We got everything. We got all the slow pokes. We got to take it back to Clara. But let me give a quick peek over here. Give a quick peek over here. We can go in there. There's little raids. Is that what is that? <gasps> what is that thing called again? Is that Power Scooter's first aid? Yeah, I forget what it's called though. He's looking dope though. 100 new Pokemon that I get to collect. It's gonna be fun. That's gonna be fun to do. Cannot wait to catch the Talon Flames and all that. I can do it right now. But look at that Fletch Chinder chilling here. I gotta find the first stage, the Fletchling, and I'd rather just evolve it with like the XP share and all that. Make it easier. Fletch Chinder chilling here. I forget. I think that thing starts with a W. I forget its name. But I know who it is. I know who it is. Yo, let's roll back to the dojo. This view, dude, that whale lord. Oh my lord. Whale lord, what's good? <laughs> my dude whale lord just chilling there. We're back at the dojo. Let me oh it just gets off my bike on my own. And we gotta go to Clara. Clara should be chilling in here. Clara in here? Yeah, we gotta be doing the right thing. It's just like automatically cutscene. Yo, what's good, Clara? What's good? Don't tell me you got my uniform back all on your own. I did. Here. I can do anything. I am the best Pokemon trainer out there. Come on. Give me Kubfu. Give me Kubfu. I want him. Did we get a pass? What are we giving us? Hmm. Just give me Kubfu, man. That's all I want. <laughs> I've been recording for about 25 minutes. I'm going to go for a little bit longer here. Oh, we get to choose now. Squirtle or Bulbasaur. Yo, who do I want? Who do I want? You know who I'm going with. Actually, I don't even know who I'm going with. Drip and Vine. Okay. Um, these are our sweet little Pokemon Bulbasaur and Squirtle. We've been taking care of them. You get to choose one. Which one do I want? Hmm, I think these are G-Max ones. You know, we're going with Squirts. We're going with Squirts. I believe they didn't give us a Charmander because uh, we already have G-Max Charizard from the other thing. So I'm going to take Squirtle. Come here, boy. I hope they put uh, in the Crown Tundra, they put another set of uh, starters, preferably Gen 4 starters, and then hint at uh, Gen 4 remake. The Squirtle has been sent to the box, which is dope. What's goody? Sorry, Bulbasaur. It looks like you're here. Looks like we gotta stay here. Remember that your new Pokemon will be able to Gigantamax once fully evolved, so be sure to raise it well. Oh my god, get in my party. We're gonna give this thing the XP charm, and we're just gonna be leveling this thing up. So he talks about the Max Soup. If you guys do not know what Max Soup is, it's like a new food that you can make. Say if you have a Toxtricity that is not G-Max, you can give it the Max Soup, and then it now is G-Max. So that's pretty dope. So next trials begin. Let the next trials begin. I'm so down with it. 
What's good? And don't worry, Bulbasaur, I'll be sure to raise you with lots of love. I gotta do three different trials. Okay. That's fine. Miss Honey, if you want that Pokemon to learn new moves, you can leave that to me. Okay. That's fine. That's totally fine. Be chilling here. Five pieces of Armorite Ore. What does that do? Is that for armor? Rare ore that can be obtained on the Isle of Armor. Something good will happen if you give it to the Collector on the Isle of Armor. Okay. It's all about the Collector. So I'm going to put Squirtle in my party. I think he just got sent to our box. Let me see. My box is filled. So I got to find the right Squirtle. And we got to take out somebody. Where's that Squirtle at? There's Klefki. Here's all these guys. Sharpedo. We got to find this dude. There he is. This is my Squirtle. Oh, yeah. His stats are pretty good. His stats are pretty good. I'm going to take out the Gyarados. And then I'm going to actually give him the XP. What is it? The XP charm? We can show off that and how that is used. It should be in key items, right? Let's see. XP charm, where you at? XP charm right here. Wait a minute. A charm that increases. Can I? You seem to... I can't give it to you? Okay, not time to use it. Okay, that's fine. That is fine. I guess I guess it just like automatically does it. Oh, where did Mustard go? Okay, we had to go over here. Is he playing video games, man? Is he playing video games? I think I just saw him playing video games. Oh, this is the Cramorant thing. So I heard, I heard a lot about this. I heard it's uh, like, you got, it's like a gambling thing. You throw items in it, and then you, what's it called? And then you can, like, gamble in it. I don't even know how it works. Like, I think you throw in, like, four items, and then it pops out something else. So I think it's like an RNG. I think it's like an RNG system. So what does this chick say? All I would like to take is a measly 500 watts. If you can get Cramorant up and running, you know. I'll get, dude, look at my watts. I'm at 147,000 watts. Take all my watts, dude. There you go. I have plenty. So there you go. Get this Cramer rant o matic started up running. Cram? Cram? <laughs> perfect. Just perfect. Put in four items you don't need. Okay, so four items that we do not need. I can put in whatever I want. And then it gambles out. It's kind of like a gambling, I heard. Let's combine items. Okay. Let's throw in items that I do not want. Such as... Let's throw in just a citrus berry. Um, Go over. Put a uh, Dynamax candy in there. And a HP up. And oh wait, we get one more. I'm gonna put in a car booster. So there you go. Take all that stuff. Okay, we get to save our progress after we do this. And it takes this. And what's it gonna give me? Master Ball. <laughs> oh, a TR. That's pretty cool. There's gotta be like a way to get Master Balls. In. There's gotta be a way to get Master Balls. Alright, let me talk to Mustard. What's he doing? He's playing He's playing the Switch. Your second trial is picking three max mushrooms. They are red with spiral patterns. I'm pretty sure they grow in dark, humid places. Okay, so dark, humid places. We're going to go pluck these real quick. I think in today's video, we're going to complete all three trials. So, that's pretty dope. We got to go find these spiral mushrooms. Dark, humid places. Mustard comes back out. What's goody? What's goody, big dog? It just dawned on me that you're brand new to the Isle of Armor. I bet you have no idea where to even begin. Look for the max mushrooms. Blah, blah, blah. Let's go for a walk. Yo, you're not showing me the max mushrooms, are you? This guy's definitely got some secrets up his sleeve. Or maybe he's just showing show me a new area. Okay, so behind that little, the new swamp area. I guess back here. Okay. This is nice, humid, dark area. Now, usually the forest of focus is chocked full of max mushrooms. But the thing is, a swarm of greeting came through and ate every last one. So, I'm thinking maybe you have some more luck finding mushrooms if you go check the warm-up tunnel. It's out on the other side of the forest. Okay, so out on the other side, there's a big old tunnel. I'm going to go check it out. Go give that a quick peek. Hey, 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 Isle of Armor. Yes, sir. Let's get it. Okay, so we got to go across here. New area. We got the Force of Focus. <gasps> Amoongus, yo. I love these mons. Oh, dude, that's dope. That's dope. I believe it's this way. Like I said, I I'm just going to be like exploring, looking at all these Pokemon. Yo, Tangilla, Bisharp, chilling here. But I'm going to be catching most of these guys on my uh, Twitch page. So is this where the warm-up tunnel is? Amoongus chilling over here. Where that warm-up tunnel at? No, we're back out here. Yo, we got a... Uh... Yo, there's the dojo. There's that big dojo that we saw in the, uh, the trailer and all that. Yes, sir. Yo, oh, is that a Pokeball? This has got to be a fake Pokeball, right? No, it's not. Yo, you guys know what I'm talking about. The fake Pokeball. <gasps> Pasimian just spawns here. It's on its own. That's cool. Where is this little uh, little section? Yo, crawled on. We got Wish Cash spawns in the water. Oh my god, yo. Isle of Armor, stop it. You have outdone yourself. Amoonguses, what's good? <laughs> Pikachu spawning. I heard something else spawn. That's crawled on. Yeah. Where's this uh this tunnel at? Oh, it should be over here. Keep going. We got this little sparkle here. What do we got here? A Galeric Twig. 
I'm gonna go look over here. Say the warm up tunnel. Training low lounge. Oh my god, we got this thing. Where's this tunnel? Oh my god, yo, there's more stuff up there. Milk tank. Dude, stop it. Can I look at like a map? Let's, let's look at my map. See if I can find like the route to take. Town map. Wait, over here. This has this. This doesn't help me at all. This doesn't help me at all. Or I. Oh wait, it says next destination. Give me a second. Next destination, the warm up tunnel. Okay, so we gotta go this way. We get max mushrooms. Okay. So wait, which way do I have to go? The warm up tunnel. I think I gotta go all the way up and up that path. The training low lounge. Yes. So I gotta make my way all the way up. Let's go. This is the training low lounge. I gotta go up this way to the warm up tunnel. Beautiful. Oh my god, it's just showing me. So I think that's what the trials do. I think the trials show you all three of the. Uh, or all these different areas. And so you kind of get familiar with the place. Lycan Rock, yo, what's good? Lycan Rock chilling here. There's someone above me. Skarmory. Whew. Whew. More Skarmories. That's amazing. This, is this warm up tunnel or is warm up tunnel around it? Hold up. I don't. I think warm up tunnel might be around it. Or no, I gotta travel down this way. Yeah, let's go down and around to warm up. Actually, I don't even know how to get the warm up tunnel. Give me one second. Where's warm up tunnel? Let's go check out the map once again. Town map. I can't really like see how to get to there. So, okay, no, there's a bridge on the other side. I went the wrong way. Okay, I got it. There's a bridge on the other side, right down there through the lowlands. Go back downwards. Let's go. Or is this the tunnel? Where did I come through at? I came through over here. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> there's another tunnel right there, but this is the way I want to go. Down this way. If you guys are following along, this is going to be the little walkthrough to get you through the Isle of Armor story mode. Then you guys can do whatever you want with your free time. Bruh. Get out of your Scyther, Pincer. Should be another bridge somewhere, right? For my capping. Am I capping? Give me the map. Or did, I think there's a little area that leads to the back. I'm going the right way, right? Yeah, the tunnel should be straightforward. I think it's right back here. Should be right back here, right? This is the tunnel I'm looking for. Come here, show me a tunnel back here. There it is. This is the exact tunnel I am looking for. Milk tanks showing here. Er, oh, skirt. Kangaskhan. What's good? Yo, dude. Owl of armor looking phenomenal. Here's a little tunnel. We got to find the mushrooms in. We have Malwax in here. What is that? This got to be the little, uh, the little uh, things that I'm looking for. No, I didn't mean to hit that. I want to hit this. Oh, this is a diglet. This is a diglet. <laughs> we found another diglet. There's the mushrooms I'm looking for. Got little items here. Give me them. A thick club. That's probably for Cubo and a Malwak. And here's one of our mushrooms. And don't you dare think. I didn't see you, Diglett. I found you. <laughs> Find one more Diglett. We're chilling. Let's go over here. And grab this. Max mushroom. Yes, sir. Hold on a sec. Does Pokemon pop out? No, Claire is here again. Oh, my God. Claire, get out of my face. Little girl. <laughs> what is this? This is the Max Mushrooms. You did not see it first. Get out of here. Don't tell me you have to battle me. Come on. Come on. Stop. Stop. Capping right here. She's capping thinking she's gonna beat me. Challenged by Pokemon trainer Clara. She's gonna send out Slowpoke. That's totally fine with me. I'm gonna slap up on that. And we all sent out big old Inteleon. What do you want, fool? Yo, I'm gonna one-tap this in. You're gonna add another Pokemon to yourself. Which is fine. And then my Inteleon just... Boop. And my what's up is going to be at levels as well. My G-Max Squirtle or G-Max Blaster or whatever you want to call it. It's going to be cool. So we're also going to get a ton of XP. Withdrawal. Rapid Spin. Uh, keep all moves. I'm going to just let it have, uh, keep it all of its old moves. Because I can go back and give it whatever moves I want later on. Because of that new thing, which is dope. Whatever it's called. I don't even know what it's called. Where you can go back and, and teach it old moves without giving it like a heart scale. I remember you would need heart scales and all that in the old game. Like Pokemon uh, Emerald and... Uh, was it Emerald? It might have been Emerald and Diamond and Pearl I know had it. To get your old moves back, you need heart too. You give it to him, and then you go from there. But yeah, level up again. 18. Squirtle's gonna bob after this. No, Squirtle. Keep your old moves, buddy. Do not learn Protect. And then we all go keep current Pokemon. Then she's gonna send out Venipede again. Yeah, you are really going to lose again. You stand no chance. Give me Cubfu. <laughs> I won Cubfu. And he sends out Whirlipede. So obviously her final Pokemon is going to be that, uh, the final stage of it. It's Elisipede, I think? It's dope looking. It's like a big old caterpillar with a bunch of spikes. Or like, I don't even know what it is. Big old centipede. We'll get some mean XP there. He's going to want to learn to move. Rain Dance. I uh, keep all moves again. Like I said, but yo, Claire, 
Get out of my face. Like I said, stand no chance. We're here to collect some mash, max mushrooms. My boy Squirtle is going to evolve into War Turtle. Let's get it, boy. Let's get it, Squirtle. Yeah, I don't even know if I have War Turtle in my... Uh... Is he going to be part of my Pokedex now? Yeah, because I don't think they were part of the Pokedex in uh, the last one. Without the DLC. Okay, that's rocking out. There we go. Get out of here. Go back home. These are my Max Mushrooms. See you later, sweetheart. <laughs> now I can collect these things. Come here. You obtain three clusters of Max Mushrooms. Okay. So now can I go back if that's three? Beep, beep, beep. <laughs> Rotom phone. Hello, is this Gene's phone? How's the trial coming along? Easy peasy. You mean you already managed to find three Max Mushrooms? I've been checking in on everybody's progress, but it seems like you're in first place again. You really are the new rising star, aren't you? I suppose I better go put a pot on the stove, but be careful on your way back. Ciao. Okay, cool. So I can head back. Is there a way? Can I fly back? Can I make things life easier for me? Yeah, I can fly back to the dojo. Let's get it. Let's get it. I can fly straight back to the dojo. Look at us. Now we're already here. Beautiful. Easy peasy. We heading in that door, and we're going to get rolling with our third and final trial. So easy enough. Yo, what's good, Mustard? Yo, this DLC, fire, yo. If you guys haven't picked up the DLC, you guys should definitely pick it up. It is going to be so much fun. I'm only doing the story right now, but I'm absolutely loving it. I'm loving it. I feel like I'm going to have a blast collecting all the new Pokemon and just exploring everything there has to offer in the Isle of Armor. But I, th I think Crown Tundra is going to put this one out the park because of all the legendaries and all that good stuff. It's just going to be unreal. But there we go. Second trial done. I think they're going to show us how to make Max Soup and all that, which is kind of lame. I'm ready for that third trial, though. I'm ready to get rolling with that third and final trial so after we eat that max soup that was just made from the max mushrooms muster says yo jeans meet me in the room over here so i'm gonna head over here and talk to him and see what's going on look at all of his trophies and stuff looking spiffy dude there you are jeans claire thanks for coming so what's this all about master what did you want to tell us well, i've decided that you two will now take the master's dojo oh final last ultimate third trial so it's just us two final last <laughs> like look at all the options we have uh, so basically this is the last trial uh, well, yes, that is the gist of it. You two are the only ones who su successfully finished the second trial. You push each other to greater heights to help each other grow. So I say it's time who is to see who's stronger in a Dynamax Pokemon battle. Let's get it. I'm ready. I am ready. Dynamax Pokemon battle? But I wish my Blastoise was all the way back up. But yeah, we got to go into the power spot, and then we battle for the third and final trial. So I'm just going to be able to slap up here. I think I'm going to change my Pokemon. I'll meet her over there. I, I think, who should I put in my front spot? Titar, Excadrill, Dragapult. I think I just Dragapult Sweep, right? I think Dragapult Sweep's the call. I'm so ready for it. Let me let me, let me put Dragapult in that front spot. Third and final trial. I believe there's a there's a good bit more of uh, what's called. Oh, I have weakness policy on this thing as well. I believe there's a good bit more to of this uh, game. Or this uh, story mode. This is just like the beginning. I gotta go out here and, yo, look at this stadium. Look at this stadium. Oh, my Lord. This game. <laughs> I know I've been saying this game a lot, but it just keeps blowing me away more and more every time I see something new. It's just the, the atmosphere is 10 times better than when I first. I think this is better than when I first saw the uh, the new wild area. It's just amazing. What's up, Claire? Are you ready to battle? I'm ready to give you the weapons. Yeah, I just beat you. When I beat you, I'll get my secret armor and I'll become the poison gym type leader. You can be the poison gym type leader. That's not what I'm here for. Yeah, y'all, I'm ready. Let's get it. Third and final trial coming at you guys. Looks like you two are ready. Yes, sir. Yes, sir, Mustardo. Good luck. Bum, 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 bum. Yo, I woke up early for this one. Caught the Pokemon presentation. Now I'm hopping. I hop straight into the Isle of Armor DLC. I already had a prepaid. Probably most of you guys did have a prepaid as well. But yeah, hopped it straight into it. Got recording. I want to upload this as soon as I can. I cannot wait to show it to you guys. For the people who do not have it or people who just want to check it out. But here we go. We're ready. The stage is like all glowy because this is a power spot. And we're going to get battling. Pokemon Trainer Claire coming out here. That's totally fine. She has four Pokemon now. She goes Scorpio. Bro, stop. You're capping. You're capping. We're going to go Poltsky here. We're going to go Poltsky. Poison? I can't believe they added more gym leaders. That's pretty cool. So do we get more gym badges? I'm down with it. I'd rather have some more gym badges. Hey, hey, jeans. Looks like some toxic spikes somehow got on them. Okay, so there's toxic spikes. Of course, I get poisoned. That's whack. And badly poisoned. I'm just going to hit this thing with a nice little dragon call. Slap it up. Yeah, you... But it feels so, like, different. Because I... Like, after I finished up my playthrough, which was, like, months ago on the uh, regular Pokemon Sword and Shield, 
I hop straight into rank battles and I haven't looked back since. Like, I've just been doing rank battles. So, it just feels different just actually playing a story mode Pokemon. Just going in, uh, battling and all that. So, it just feels so different, but it feels so nice. I think it's glaring wheezing and the level scaling is uh, pretty good. No effect there. I'm just going to go steal when it's super effective. You know, it's not stab, but still. Should be able to eat on that one tap it, right? Yep, see you later, wheezing. She's like absolutely stunned. Like, I've been playing this game for 400 hours. My Pokemon are level 100. I'm ready to whap on you. But it's going to be cool eventually getting uh, the Blastoids, well, GMAX Blastoids and all that. And I'm glad they put in a uh, Max Soup. I think that's so cool. So now we don't really have to grind too much to get the GMAX Pokemon. We can kind of just capture a Pokemon, get the EVs and all that up, and then give it the Max Soup, and bang, yo, we got a GMAX whatever Pokemon we want. Well, well, that has a form. And then Dragon Call, get that big old stab damage. Then I believe she is going to, what's it called? I believe she has Slowpoke, and I believe this is a Dynamax field, so I think we can Dynamax, so. Or she might have a slow bro and she might Dynamax that to show it off. But let's see what happens here. Poison ticks away. That's totally fine. That's totally fine. Slow bro, yes. Yeah, see, I told you, yo. I, I remember this from the trailer. We see a big Gigantamax or Dynamax slow bro. So I think this is what we're going to see. We're going to see big old slow bro. I'm going to one tap this thing up. Like, he doesn't want the smoke. He doesn't want the smoke. Ready? Give it that max warm one. Or should I give it max phantasm? Hmm. Let's go warm one here. Ban it, dan it, dan it, ban it, dan it, dan it, get it! But is there slow king? Or is there only slow bro? Because all I've seen so far is just slow bro. So maybe the crown tundra could give us slow king? Galarian slow king? Something along those lines. Because you can't have slow bro without slow king. Like, that's not a thing. And yo, look how much HP I have 636. <laughs> <laughs> just an absurd amount But I think she's going to Dynamax as well. Let's see what happens here. Does she not? No, she does. Look at that Brings it into a big Pokeball and we're going to see that trailer big old slow bro. Let's check it out. Ooh, Ooh, that thing looking spicy Looking spicy, baby <laughs> Look at this little gun. It has like a little cannon on its uh, left hand. Just pow pow pow. Start popping off on us But yeah, we coming out of here. Max Roman comes out of here. Yeet! Get him! Do we just one tap it? Easy! Yo, we eating, baby! We eating! <laughs> Light work. But you guys know what I came here for. Give me Cub Koo. Give me Cub Foo. Give it to him. Give me it. War Turtle, level 29. We're gonna be leveling him up. And we're gonna be grinding. So, third trial, easily completed. The first three trials were so easy. But I heard you can, uh, Take on the DLC whenever you want. Like if you just start off the start off the game, you can go straight to the DLC without even like beating the first gym or something like that. Just as long as you hit the Wedgehurst station and buy it. There we go. Complete the third trial. Yes, we are amazing. We are the Pokey God sent from the Galar region. Whooping. Now we own the Isle of Armor. Now we own Galar and the Isle of Armor. Next stop is Crown Tundra. <laughs> I cannot wait for that one. That one's just gonna be hype for like catching all the new legendaries and seeing like the nostalgia Pokemon like Palkia and all that. I think it's gonna be amazing. Uh, what's up, Mustard? You got you got something for me? I completed everything. I did all your trials. And now give me Cub Foo. <laughs> I'm hoping we get him after this. I really am. He's so cool. Cub Foo's like a little Kung Fu panda. <laughs> they had to take some, uh, like, uh... Like, they, they were definitely watching Kung Fu Panda when they were... When they came up with the Isle of Armor DLC. They're like, how about we do a Kung Fu bear? And then everyone's like, yeah, Kung Fu bear! <laughs> But we get the secret armor for completing all three trials. We're the only ones who, or the only person who did it. Give me my secret armor. Jeans, what's good, Claire? You here to apologize? Um, well, I, well, uh, yeah. Oh, we got our glee card. There we go. I'll take that. But I don't think this is the last time we're going to see Clara. I believe we're going to verse her again later on in the story here. But beautiful. Finish up that. And now we are back at the dojo. And where's Mustard? Let's talk to Mustard here. Mustard, hello there. Ah, uh, there you are, Jeans. Keeping this old man waiting, hmm? Yes, sir. That's what we're doing. Since you completed all three trials, I'll give you the secret armor for the Master Dojo. Yes, sir. Now then, come on out. <gasps> this is my boy. <gasps> Kung Fu! Yes, sir! My dude, look at him! My dude! <laughs> I love him. Yo, he's so sick! Do I get him? Look at this dude! Look at this dude! Give him to me! Give him to me! Oh, he's like scared. <laughs> Hides behind mustard. 
Kung Fu, come out. I'm your best friend. I am your best friend. I will never hurt you. You are going to be on my team. Give me Kung Fu. <laughs> Bear? This Pokemon is in fact the secret armor of the Master Dojo. Say hello to Kung Fu. I know, I know. It's tiny, but raise it with diligence and it will become strong enough to see you through battle just like a suit of armor. No opponent will be able to get past it. This one in particular has a major potential. Probably it's a bit shy. It just doesn't seem to have much confidence in itself. So I was thinking, Jeans, maybe if it joins you on an adventure, that'll help it break its shell a little bit. So take good care of Kung Fu. It's in your hands now. Let's go. I got my boy Kung Fu. Come here, dude. Uh, Berma? <laughs> Dude, look at his little, like, uh, his headband. His little ninja headband. I love it. I love this thing's design. Yo, what's good? Don't we give, like, high five or something? Yo, turn that frown upside down. Yeah, there it is. Kung Fu became your Pokemon. Let's go. That is what I wanted to do. We get him registered in our Pokedex as well, which is so cool. Look at this little boy. Kung Fu has been sent to our box. I got to put him all in our squad. First things first. Ba ba ba. Let's explore. Yeah, we know this. Got a great view of armor, but yo, there we go. First three trials completed. I'm going to throw this boy into our party and check him out. I'm going to see his stats and all that real quick before we do finish off the episode. This thing just follows around. That'll be cool if he follows, follows us on feet, but I think he's in our box. So yeah, he's in our box. Let's go check him out real quick. Uh, Boot, where you at, big dog? He's going to take probably Shane in the lower spot. Uh, Boot, what level you want? 10. It's uh, decent stats. Let's check his summary. Is three perfect IVs. He has Rock Smash, Leer, Indoor, and Focus Energy. So we're definitely going to have to be training this bad boy up. Let's move him over. And we'll take out Chandelure. What's good? Let's go. We got Kung Fu. But guys, that is going to be it for today's video. If you did enjoy the content, don't forget to smash that like button for me. And if you're new here, click that big red subscribe button so you know when my videos go live. As in the next episode of us playing the Isle of Armor, we're going to be exploring more and continuing on with the story. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out, everyone.